All right, so we are down on the stream. I've only ever nymphed this stream. I'm out here today. We're gonna throw streamers on it. Hopefully we can get into something. Water's pretty, uh, pretty clear. Nice little flow to it though. I think it's still on the lower side, but it's clear. So I got an olive little mini dungeon on and uh, I got some weight since we're in this pocket water area. But once I get up above in the slower pools, probably take that off because I'm using like a slightly weighted streamer. But it's a beautiful day out. Temps, air temps are probably around 50. I don't know what the water temp is. Uh, I'm guessing probably in like the mid 40s, lower lower 40s, maybe even higher 30s. But we're gonna go ahead and get to it here and uh, stay tuned. All right guys, we're hooked up. It's a rainbow. Not a bad one. So we hooked into the first fish here. It's a rainbow. If I can get him out of the net. It's actually not a bad fish. He took that all of dungeon. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get an underwater release of him. up here finally so we just hooked up with that brown I'm kind of just working up through these uh, riffles I, I passed a bunch of slow water and I didn't get any fish, so I, I figured I'd stop and fish the rifts again and swing my streamer through. And we just got this guy here. That's the first brown of today. So I'm gonna go ahead and release him. Right now I'm just working this little olive mini dungeon. Uh, I've used this in past videos here. It's got like the little silver lead eyes. I had a red lead eyes one on before, but it got caught in the tree, so I threw this on to switch it up just a teeny bit. So we're gonna go ahead and get back out of here. I've been working up through here, just caught another one here. This is a beautiful trout. I would say it's definitely wild, not like a holdover, because I don't even know if they stock brownies in this creek just rainbows but he's definitely got a messed up fin I don't know if maybe from someone else catching him or something but you know they can have a little bit of messed up fin just naturally see it's kind of beat up there beautiful fish though so I'm gonna go ahead and get a release on him and we'll uh, continue up through Hooked into another little guy here. I missed a few more. Um, <clears throat> hoping maybe they're like turning on here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get him unhooked. I had that black streamer on for a while and I uh, lost that in the uh, tree. So I switched back to the olive, which is what I've gotten everything on today. Once I get him unhooked here, we'll go ahead and do an underwater shot. So calling it a day here I think I only landed like three or four fish today but I mean you're not gonna have great days always so um, I, I just stopped at this creek basically on my way to uh, my next destination <clears throat> so I'm, I'm walking out now and uh, missed a few fish the ones that I missed they seemed a little bigger but I mean what can you do that's just how streamer fishing goes basically make sure to subscribe for more videos in the future Leave a like on this video also. It helps keep my morale up to keep making the videos and then leave any comments for suggestions for videos you guys would like to see. I got the suggestion for showing you guys how I have my rod and reel set up. So I did that video. Look on my channel for that. 
Stay tuned for the next video and peace.